I'm an arm. I'm sure you'll understand if I don't take your word for it. You're clearly very skilled. I want to thank you for holding yourself in check on the way in. My friends only want to protect me, but there's been too much bloodshed already. You don't seem surprised to see me. I'm not. After the train station attacks, I knew it was only a matter of time before they sent someone. Please, sit. This isn't a social call, Rucker. I'm here to take you in. Our mandate is to fight for the rights of the Augmented. Communicate our message, offer assistance. The Ark is a non-violent organization. All right, then this should be easy. Come with me, answer our questions, and we'll have you back here in plenty of time to film your next sermon. I'm not a fool. If I surrender now, I'm never coming back. Once you have me, you intend to make me disappear. But I will not make Solzhenitsyn's mistake. My people and I will resist you. I thought you were a pacifist. I am. But I'm more than a leader. I am a symbol. That is why you wish to erase me. If martyrdom is the only way to remain a symbol, then even my death is preferable to my evaporation. If I have to bring you in by force, I will. And your people will try to stop me. And neither of us wants anyone to get hurt, so come along peacefully. You have my word. I will do everything I can to see that you are treated fairly. You cannot speak to me of peace or fairness. Not when your masters hide in the shadows, manipulating, controlling, murdering without the courage to proclaim their convictions in front of the rest of the world. Come off it, Rucker. You've been preaching pacifism for years from your ivory tower. Now all of a sudden your convictions are really being tested and you're tossing them away. No, that's... Let me explain. The augmented peoples of the world have been stripped of their power. There are so few advocates remaining. The cause needs people like me to stem the tide of hatred before all humanity drowns in it. You're lecturing me about the state of all rights? I get the same looks. I go through the same checkpoints. And things are getting worse, so your plan obviously isn't working. I know. And it tears at me. I have been trying desperately to think of a better way, but so far, nothing. This is a very precarious time for the movement. These attacks are making everything worse for us. My leadership position within Ark is being threatened, and I suspect the two might even be connected. Please, go back to your people. Tell them to give me 48 hours so I can attempt to resolve the internal conflict. I'm sorry. If I go back empty-handed, I'll just be replaced. Probably by someone more eager and less sympathetic. Coming in now is honestly the best thing you can do for everyone. Yes. I suspect you are right. But can you understand this? If you were to take me from here, you would be responsible for more than my death. You would be responsible for my effacement, the ruination of the Augmented Rights Coalition, and the perversion of everything it stands for. The bottom line hasn't changed. If you come with me willingly, there won't be any violence. You now have the choice. Choose the non-violent path, or you are the one betraying the cause. I... I cannot watch any more of my people die. Not on my account. You have asked me to trust you, and so... I will. Before we leave together, there is something I must show you. I suspect there is a power struggle brewing within our organization. Some 
people inside Ark are less committed to our ideals. Are you trying to tell me you know who's responsible for the bombings? I have only suspicions, and until recently not even that. The evidence I have begun collecting is meager, but I give it to you. This is the key card for the security door. The evidence is inside. Why give it to me? Why not keep it, present it at your interrogation? Because if my suspicions are correct, and I am seen leaving here with you willingly, I may not survive to present my evidence. Somewhere down there, hiding in plain sight, is your real terrorist. I was trying, secretly, to find out who is responsible. Rucker? Rucker is dead. Come again. I'll fill you in when I see you, which is where exactly? There's some greenhouses near your position. Below them is a clearing. That's where I'll be. On working. Things are definitely getting better. What are you talking about? That bitch Eliza Kassan is saying terrible lies about the Rucker. Yes, but they are obvious lies. People will see through them. When the Human Restoration Act comes to a vote in the UN, tell us what happened. I wish I shared your So, I'm still walking. Over.
lot of goddamn good Rucker being dead is going to do for us. Your orders were to bring him in. I fully intended to. Then how did this happen? I think someone being paid to manipulate Ark killed him. Someone in his crew. Rucker told me Ark was being set up. That the real terrorists were hiding in plain sight. And was he wearing a tinfoil hat when he said this? The man was devoted to bridging the divide between Augs and Naturals. He knew that every one of these attacks just drives the stake in deeper, and that the only way to fix things was to pull that stake out. He said he had evidence to prove Ark's innocence. He was ready to come in and talk to us, even though he knew it meant risking his life. What evidence was he referring to? I don't know. He was killed before he could say. Well then, there's no use theorizing over what ifs, is there? What about Viktor Marchenko? I ran that name through iLink and got back a blank page. Why? You got something else? Nothing more than a gut feeling, so far. Well, I'm sorry, Agent, but I need more than that. Christ. What a mess. You know word of Rucker's death is going to spread, don't you? And when that happens, the head of state police assures me Golem City will become a war zone. We can't let that happen. I hope we're good on juice, Chicane, because I need a ride. As for you, Agent... I still have a case to solve, and I know exactly where to start, Director. Smiley's had more than enough time to analyze that DSD I gave him. The one you took from Rizika? I'll check in with him, see what's on it. After that, I'll go where the evidence takes me. I intend to make sure the right people are brought to justice for this, whether they're augmented or not. Get a move on, before this case gets any colder, and keep me in the loop! Let's go, Chicane. Rucker's dead. What? Poisoned, I think. Holy shit, man. Rucker was the voice of the Augmented. People loved him for it. When word of this hits, Prague is gonna explode. And the whole world's watching. Listen, Miller's gone to meet with state police. Could be our chance to determine his loyalties. He lives near TF-29. You want us to search his apartment? Not us. Me. You keep digging into that Versalife break-in. And see what the Collective can dig up on a Viktor Marchenko. If I'm right, and Rucker was poisoned, all three might be connected. Jensen out. What's going on? Miller sent me to. Checking my progress? Really? I said it would be done when it's done. You can't rush these things, Adam. Excellence takes time. Right. So... Well, I was right. Am I good or am I good? What did you find? Oh, just some isolated fragments from what looks like Bomb's timing mechanism. And get this, it's a Stanic. Stanic? The Bomb's timing mechanism was a wristwatch? Well, to address your incredulous tone, a mechanical timing mechanism is not as silly as it sounds. Security scanners can detect anything with a suspicious electronic circuit, so... Using a low-tech solution is really clever. Stanic watches are custom-made locally. I think I'll pay the shop a visit. Mm, it's probably closed. 
Let's see if I can find you a second option. Yeah, got it. Nomad Stanek, founder and owner of the store, lives in the Davnia Vod district near Pilgrim Station. That's Putnik Nadraji in Czech, I, I think. Building number 96, second floor. Nice, I'll check it out. Great, let me know how it goes. Thank you. 